Hey guys, welcome back to World Trains and Such. Um, I'll come out in the garage tonight to do a little bit on the 5 inch gauge electric chassis or loco, should we say. Um, so far, I've got the wheels back in, I've got the axle boxes all in, um, motors are back in, belts are on, um, and the springs are back in. Well, most of them, I'll flip you around and show you. So, um, the motors are back in, all bought underneath. I've got uh, the springs in. They're all strapped down. I've also put these pieces in here. I just need to put a grub screw in there now. It's actually in the house, sat, sat next to the microwave. But that's done and on. And that's done and on. And that'll stop that wheel going that way. If you can see, down in that one, that bushing down there, when it focuses, stops it going that way. And also, this gear stops it going that way. Put that bushing, there's a bushing down there as well. And also, that one there just stops this wheel moving that way because that's what happened last time. So that's uh, that's where we're at. I've got a bolt to put back in, in there, if you can see that. Also got, oh, I thought I had one more to put in. I've got the pickup hitch to put back in there. Oh, bit of paint to touch up here and there. By the looks of it, that's coming along nicely. Um, I've got to put all the electrics back on it, of course. But I just thought I'd pop on and give you a little update of how it's going. Really well. I actually had to change this method around because I originally I had the back of the bolt in here, but the issue I didn't want to. In order to put put them in that way, I had to split all this, take this frame off, take that frame off, put them on individually, and oh, it was too much of a nightmare. So what I ended up doing was putting the bolts through that way and just trimming the ends off here and here right at the end so that is actually ready to be flipped upside down and I've all the electrics put back in so that is as far as we've got it's a far cry from what it used to look before it was painted but it's it's all painted now I think it looks quite rather nice I think so anyway. Anyway, um, I'm going to go. It's just a quick couple of minute video just to show how far I've got. Um, if you like the video, give it a like. If you are interested in this sort of thing and like enjoy watching an idiot like me um, messing about in a workshop, then why not subscribe? So, we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.